So you might be wondering why your Snapchat is not updating. Now the Snapchat application, I'm sure everyone knows, it's an app that allows you to go ahead and send photos, videos, whatever. Now the number one reason why this application is not updating is usually due to some Wi-Fi or internet problems. So what I would recommend doing for the most part is going through and making sure your Wi-Fi connection and your internet connection or data connection are properly set up and they're properly working. A lot of the times the reason why these things don't work is because of those exact problems. So just make sure your Wi-Fi connection and everything are perfectly fine and then you should be good to go for the most part. Now for some reason that doesn't seem to be working. The next thing you want to do is go and make your way over to your device. So make your way over to your device. Go ahead and find your App Store or Google Play Store. Go and click search and all you want to do is search for that application. So in this case, we'll just go ahead and search up Snapchat. So go and search up Snapchat as you normally would. And what you want to do here is you want to go ahead and find the Snapchat application and all you're going to want to do is go ahead and click update. Now, the reason why Snapchat may look like there's an update, but you know it just doesn't work, or maybe it just goes update and then it just you know, cancels it, is because sometimes your phone is just glitching and you're just going to have to just address it. So all you're gonna do here is just make sure that within your phone itself, you don't have any problems. So just click on update. And then once it updates, then you're good. If it doesn't update, then again, check your internet connection. And you may wanna just check the storage you have on your device. Sometimes your iPhone or Android, whatever it is, sometimes you may not have enough storage saved on your device. So go and find your storage panel on your device and just make sure you have enough storage saved. As you can see, I'm almost running out of storage on this iPhone, so I may have to delete some stuff. So just make sure you have enough storage and that can pretty much fix the problem too. So those are pretty much the main ways to do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.